Thank you to College Board for sponsoring this video. Uh, so I'm gonna... Okay, <laughs> oh. kisses. Hey, thanks. Bye, I love you guys. And when I got there, the camera was gone. I am a night owl. Good morning, everybody, and happy Saturday. Daddy -o and I on the boat this morning. It's a little bit windy, so sorry if you guys hear the wind. We are headed downtown to put some gas in the boat because we are flashing empty. Where does it show up, Mikey? Right there. Right. Oh, I see, right there. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. That one right there, yes. But first we're gonna pick up Ryan. He's supposed to meet us at the end of this pier. He slept over at his friend Grammy's house last night. We're waiting on him and we're a little bit concerned we might run out of gas. All right, Ryan has arrived. Run! Yo, we've been waiting on you. Oh, first time in the boat. Oh my oh, gosh. Oh. This is your first time this season? Yes. Oh my gosh, Ryan, yay! Oh, oh, oh you're just gonna oh, wiggle around in it? What'd you say? Yes. We're running out of gas, Ryan, so we might not make it there. No, really, we went downtown to get gas last night, the thing was closed, so we used all the gas to come back home. Now we need to go back down. Tight. Wait, what? So what are you eating those gas? Well, then you're gonna have to paddle. What do you have over here? Did you eat something? is in sight. Dad was just saying to Ryan, if we run out of gas, be sure to keep your head. Don't freak out. So we went over a couple waves and Dad <laughs> stopped the boat or <laughs> slowed it down and Ryan goes, Whoa! was that it? Was that it? <laughs> he He's definitely like, did not keep his head. He slowed it down because like, we were in the six mile an hour So, um, I got so scared. <laughs> um, so much for keeping your head. Yeah, right? <laughs> now we're here. Thank Same goodness we're going to make it. Brennan is entering his, or actually finishing up now, his sophomore year in high school and starting to really think about college and what college, like the college application process and what colleges he might want to look at. So, Brennan, what you got going there? Just looking up some college scholarships, going to college soon, and um, I'm on this college board site, and um, this college board opportunity scholarship is... Um, uh, website where you can go on, do all the things you normally do to go to college, and you get uh, money, you mm -hmm. get scholarship opportunities for it. Okay. No minimum GPA, SAT, application requirements, and um, the harder you, more effort you put in to the scholarships, the bigger chance you have to uh, get money to go to college. That's pretty cool. I was looking at it earlier, and you guys, this is an awesome opportunity because you, what you do is you actually go through the steps that you would normally go through to apply for college, like looking at colleges, taking the SATs, that kind of thing, and each step that you take earns you a chance to win scholarship dollars at each step. So basically, yeah, right? So basically they're kind of rewarding you or giving you a chance to earn money by, by doing all the six steps that are necessary for a college um, application, which is really cool. There are about 4,000 students each year um, are awarded scholarship dollars. Uh, they have $5 million that they give away. So they've earned, 4,000 students have earned between $500 and $40,000. And the cool part about it is, if you complete all six steps, you're entered for a chance to win $40,000 in scholarships. Grand. Can you imagine that? What a burden like that would lift from mm -hmm. your college. Um, mm -hmm. College experience, mm -hmm. yeah. So you guys too, uh, all the viewers can join the College Board Opportunity Scholarships. With a free College Board account, there's no purchase necessary. And uh, the official program rules should be in the link below. Yeah, yep, yep. yep. So you guys check that out, totally free of cost, no purchase necessary. Yeah, so we'll put the we'll put the link right in the description. So click on it, just Google around or oodle around and see what you got going on do there. Some, do some research on colleges. Yeah. And get rewarded for it. I know, that's really cool. Well, good luck, Brennan. Thank you. You're welcome. See we'll we'll leave you be. I'll see what I see. <laughs> okay. Hello, Kati. Hi. Welcome back from your sleepover. What you doing? Putting on mascara. Oh, very good. We're about to go to the Amish market to eat some food with Kyla and her sister. What are you going to get there? 
Have it's you ever been there before? Because I worked out this morning. Oh, good for you. What'd you do? I work out. Good. There's not much healthy at the Amish market, so you're really gonna have to search oh, for I just it. Get fruit. Okay, that's probably a good idea. Oh, my eyebrows look terrible, but I have to go because. And then you're going to a baseball game. It's time to go. Yeah, then we're gonna be fun. Fun. All right. Good luck. I'm like late for them. I feel really bad. Okay. Well, do you have like cash? I'm just gonna grab this five bucks. <coughs> I do. Do you need to, cash to get in? Better All right. Go. We're gonna let Katie go. Love you. Bye. Okay, bye. Okay, so Dad's like, what is that? I was like, it's a beanie. I'm like, these guys are going to the like, air show at the Andrews Air Force Base, which is kind of a military thing. He hates like, know. he hates like hoodie things. I put my chain on, like. <laughs> okay, well, show your sunglasses. Let's see what that whole outfit looks like together. I, the beanie is fine. This is this is fun. I'm gonna, so I'm gonna, yeah, I'm Actually, that's kind of cute. I love those sunglasses, and they glow in the dark. Which is funny because somebody commented, why would you get glow in the dark sunglasses? Because you don't wear sunglasses in the dark. They do. Why? I say, good point. I don't know. Maybe that's why they were on sale. Yeah, right. I mean, we got these in the UK because my eyes were red. We did. We're outside of the Tower of London. Yeah. Nice. Hey guys. Um, so today I woke up and I was at Kyla's and then we came home and then I did a workout and then I went to. Um, high school baseball game and then I came back here and now I was here downtown. That was a really quick summary of what that happened was a today. Quick summary of what but you my ride is here so I have to blast. So where are you going now? Downtown. Oh what are you gonna do? I don't know. I'll just walk around. Walk around. And visit. Yeah. Will we see you tonight? Probably. Alright, well am I picking you up? Um probably not. Hmm. I'll figure it out. Know. I'll let you know. Oh. Hey kisses. Hey okay, thanks. Bye, I love you guys. All right, you guys, we are back at the house. Well, I've been at the house all day. And Mike and Brennan and Dad went to the air show at Andrews Air Force Base. I don't know if I told you guys about that earlier, if they were gonna do that, but Andrews Air Force Base is a huge Air Force Base outside of Washington, D.C. that has a ton of planes, and they, I don't even know if I'm saying it right, but they went to the air show there, and the Blue Angels were there, and there was, what, helicopters and planes, and. What was there, Mike? Great stuff, huge, unbelievable aircraft that you would be seeing right now, but um, sadly I left the camera. I was so excited watching the Blue Angels that I took the camera and there was like a, a snow fence. So I just took it and put it around the snow fence and, and hung it on the snow fence thinking I would walk away with it. And Everybody started to go because there's a lot of people there. So I ran. We were we were running and we to the bus. the bus, shuttle bus, and then I realized I didn't have the camera. So I ran all the way back, and when I got there, the camera was gone. I'm so angry. I'm so bummed out. Dumb. 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 So there. So the the vlog or the video that you got today from the air show is on that camera. Right. right. Got it. Brendan was talking about his college. Uh, research oh, yeah. and all that stuff that he was doing. Okay. Great shots of the planes. I think they got a little bit of it, but. On their phone. All right, so this is the deal. Brendan and Ryan said when they got home, they told me the story and they said that they did get some video on their phones. So let's show some video from the air show. And then there might be bits and pieces here <laughs> and there that you're not going to get. <laughs> okay, we'll be shopping for a new camera on Monday. <laughs> just, just dead getting angry. <laughs> check their engine instruments and give Captain Doyle a thumbs up indicating they're ready to go. With a signal from each of his wingmen, Captain Doyle will call for the selection of afterburner and the Blue Angel Diamond will initiate today's aerial demonstration. Yeah, we'll be there. Osmo, updated winds of 070 at 7. We on the airfield and the airspace. You are clear for takeoff. Have a good one. Thanks, bro. Clear for takeoff. Solo's ready to rock Andrews, boss. Oh, from here for takeoff. The winds are 070 and 7. That's on that crosswind. 
Check your pocket brake on. Check your nose. Check your nose. Little steering uh, maneuver. Dive in. Ask for okay. To the left. Turn out. Pocket pussy. Dale. Down front nine. Let's fire it up for Jordan Bay's Andrews. And turn up. Now to the left. Captain Doyle calls. Smoke on. Off brakes now. Burners ready now. And the Blue Angel Diamond is rolling. As it has before you, you'll notice the smoke is not this bad. The engine's on. Right. falls asleep and you come down and get more action. Okay, well, anyway. Uh, Do you want to hear about their show? It was so sick. Really? It was so sick. Um, I'm talking about the vlog right now. It was amazing. And they did, they did so many cool things. It was, like, it's so cool to see those fighter jets. Uh, like, like 400 miles an hour. Oh crazy. my gosh, and they're loud. Yeah, loud. what? Yeah, it was really loud. Well, thank you for okay. sharing um, yeah. your video with us. I appreciate I it. You. Love you. Hi. Uh, I know she's so cute hiding under the table. How's your eye? Her one eye, oh, it's getting better. Her one eye was closing, I don't know why. Oh, now you want to play with the string from the camera. Do you want to see yourself? Look at, who's that? Who's that pretty kitty? Hi, that's you. What are you doing? She just got back home from her friend's house and now it's, the night is not ending for Kate. She's full of energy. Be back at midnight, ladies and gentlemen. It's just a midnight curfew. I. I'm a night owl. Yeah, yes, you are. I think um, I'm an owl. That's all I have to say. You are not a morning person. No, ma'am. I do want you to get your sleep. Because you know you have to be ready for tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? What? You know what tomorrow is? Tomorrow's Sunday. No, championship Sunday. Wait, dudes. You know what tomorrow is? It's championship Sunday. What does that mean? I'm really championship. Okay, anything else? That's all I care homework. about. That's all I care about. I have a lot of homework. That's all I care about tomorrow. Well, I mean, what else is on today? What else could be more exciting than championship time? Maybe we should go to church. Oh, we're def definitely going to church in the morning. No, I'm live streaming the game at church. I have someone's birthday, what's tomorrow? Is it your birthday? Or it's Mother's Day. <laughs> oh my gosh! Katie! I knew that. Did you know? Okay, alright, good. That's why I said it's Mother's Day and your ear is just to play along. So I need everybody to get a good night's sleep because it'll be a big day tomorrow of taking care of mama. I guess I can make you breakfast tomorrow morning. You could? I can't. No, Thank I can you, make Kate. you breakfast better. You can? No. What are you gonna, you're not gonna make me a donut, are you? I don't want a donut. No, I'm gonna <laughs> No, thank you. No donuts for me. All right, then big day. Be sure Sleep to watch in. tomorrow, you guys. Sleep in. 
Not really. We have to go to church early. You know why? Because Brennan has two water polo games I get to watch, and it's one of my favorite things to do, too. Yes, at 11 and 12. What, uh, it's at 10? Yeah. I think it's at 10. A live stream in the game. Okay. At church. Oh, really? Yeah. You think they'll have it up? Okay, that's a good idea. I'm a, I'm a acid priest. Okay. Do you mind if I, yeah. I mean, I'm here and all. Yeah. Do you mind if I go ahead and, okay. How warm are you in church? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I think that'd be fine. Actually? Yeah. I didn't think you'd say yes to that. Yeah, no, I think I, I think that'd be fine. Hey. Yes. Hey. 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 All right. What's up, guys? It's Brennan. And um, I'm on my way to bed. It's 11:40. They're watching Castaway back there. A movie about the volleyball. They keep talking. I think it's really annoying, but. I mean, it's their movie, so what we maybe have today was going to Angie's Air Force Base and seeing all their cool planes. It was insane watching the Blue Angels perform. It was crazy. I mean, the Thunderbirds were pretty cool too, but so I want to come below me to guys have a good just tomorrow. Yeah, so uh, we finished <laughs> up watching Castaway. It's a really good movie. It was good. Stuff on an island and stuff. You guys, comment below if you've seen Castaway and if you did, if you liked it or not. If you haven't seen it, I liked it. It was good. It was considered a comedy and a drama. It said on the thing, so yeah. it was like kind of funny. It was actually funny. Yeah, right. It was a... And um, and very dramatic. It really makes you think. Like you know, movies when they end, and sometimes you like just get up and walk away, but sometimes you like think. Yeah. It was really. I don't think it's a true story. No. But it could happen, I suppose. Maybe. Crazy. All right, so what made you happy today, Bubbaloo? What made me happy today was uh, definitely watching that, go to Andrews Air Force Base, watching the mm. Blue Angels, seeing the planes, everything. That was super fun. And uh, that's pretty much it. I had a good day all around. All right. Very good. What you think? What you got? I would say, what you, what you got? Yeah, what you got? got? I say what made me happy today. I really wish I could have gone to the air show, but I had work to do around here. So it was nice being here by myself and getting a ton of stuff done. Did I already tell you guys I cleaned out the linen closet? That was awesome. Just, um, <laughs> I did. I did a bunch of homework this week and a bunch of like makeup work. And I'm so proud of myself. Oh, well, you should be proud of yourself. Being productive makes you feel good, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So that, and then watching this movie with you was awesome. Yeah. I really enjoyed definitely. that. Oh, and then this morning, Dad and I went, oh, well, the three of us went on the boat. Dad and I went, and then oh, you went yeah. on the boat. That was fun, the boat, too. that was fun. A little cold, but it was still good. A little cold, yeah. <laughs> All right, you guys, so hope you had a wonderful Saturday. Right, there you go. Um, and we want to hear what made you guys happy today. Um, hope you guys did tomorrow, be, make sure to watch Gomez City Championship Sunday tomorrow. That's pretty much it. Yes. Uh, it's May it's, I tomorrow. thought you said Gomez City. You said Go Man City. Go Man City. Okay, Go, Go Man City. Gomez yes. City. All uh, right, you guys. So big day tomorrow. And if you guys enjoyed this video, share it with someone who else who sure. else you think would like it. Share and comment down below. Uh, thumbs yeah. up. Subscribe. Do, do all that good stuff. <laughs> Come on, you guys have a day. Peace out. See you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later. Oh,